Hi guys, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Mighty Number no. 9. In this part, we're going to be taking on the Capitol Building to fight Mighty Number no. 8, Code 9... Blah, 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 blah. Code name Counter Shade, not Code 9. Now, this seems like it's going to be the last level, but if I was going to take a guess, I'd say another one will pop up after this one. But this is the last of the Mighty Numbers we need to face. We'll see how well we do in this you one. All set, then? Yep. Uh, if you've been keeping up with the Let's Play, you'll know that I haven't quite been doing so well with these. Alright. Well, that isn't too difficult considering all the lines coming from him. That's more like it. Search for counter shade. Was I supposed to go back again there? <laughs> Run along now, little doggy. Run and fetch for your human masters. He still has his sights on you, Beck. Be careful. <laughs> Bring it on. <laughs> what is I can't tell what's going on in this, I'll be perfectly honest. Here we go. <laughs> Let's just get through. Okay, search for counter shade again. Deck move, counter shade. Deck move. I'm still searching for counter shade. And now even the fucking pedestals are robots. Get up there. Two, three. Fuck you, robot. Oh my god. I needed that. Right, they're coming quite quick now from the sound, so I'm going to assume he's just through here somewhere. I don't even know what these things do because they keep dying before they actually do anything. Right, now I might find out. Okay. This guy's got to have some sight lines just going all the way through this building from where I began. God damn it. That's more like it. Oh search for count Jesus. Have I just done a loop of the place? Oh Is that what it is? It's a giant loop, and I just have to keep going between the rooms till I find him. Right. Right, now that I know that, I feel like I can just... There you are. 
now see where the sight lines come from. They're coming from this way. Right, I get it now. Wondering what happened to all the humans here, little doggy. They ran away. Cowards. Every single one of those meat sticks fled at the first sign of trouble. Pathetic. Well, if they got a teleporting robot who what? See? Stay here. Wait for electricity to go. Oh, he's moved again. Maybe you can be content serving the whims of these flesh bags, but not me. My first executive order as the first robot president will be to set all bots free. The first robot president. Need a little assistance, Spec? No. I don't know what you were doing there, Dino. I'm sorry. Oh, so they're all going to aim for me because of these little turret things he set up. Right, where are you, Counter Shade? Can't get to him. Well, first of all, fuck you. Fuck you three times as hard. Right, hopefully, now that I know what I'm doing, this won't be nearly as bad. Fuck's sake, trash can move. Maybe I should have actually listened to what he was saying. But most of the time they just speak crap, so I just ignored what they were on about. And then you've come to the foreground. Just have to lay into you a bit. Trace lines are coming from back again. Right, so it'd definitely be worth my time to. Oh, it'd definitely be worth my time to get rid of the enemies as we're going through because they don't seem to respawn either. There he is. Now, oh, where are the sights coming from? I'm coming back from this way again. If I can just get him hopping between these two corridors, then that'd be great. Fuck me, can't believe it's Here we go. Here we go. Oh not good. <laughs> Fucking hell. Bring it on. That's more like it. Come on, Counter Shade. I haven't got all day. Oh, motherfucker. Not the only robot tired of the status quo. So, any rooms where those electric pulses are set up? Right, but I'm guessing you're not the still not the main villain of this though. It'll be that. Let me up there. Something's wrong with my con mother. Oh no. Fuck. 
fucking hell. All the all the buttons were messed up then. I couldn't actually figure out what was what. Oh, I still don't feel this is a... The only part of this I don't like is is whenever I enter a new room, the game seems to take a little bit to load it in almost. It's like... I don't know, maybe each scene in this is longer than it is on a typical level. But every time I enter a new room for the first time in each life, the game stutters. Mighty number eight signal has vanished. I have lost the target. My apologies. It's not your fault. It's what I built. What I'm getting from this, Doctor Weiss, is you're a fucking idiot, and you built all these robots to do specific tasks, never thinking of what would happen if they went the other way. And now they have gone the other way. And it sucks. I think it might be the same pattern each time. Wondering what happened to all the humans here, little doggy. They ran away. Cowards. Every single one of those meat sticks fled at the first sign of trouble. Well, as I said before, you're a teleporting sniper robot, which seems to be able to lay down a line of sight down the world's longest corridor. Here we go. Here we go. Bring it on. That's more. Than... Bring it on. That's more. Than... All right, we'll trick this again. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Right. See, I'm not the only robot tired of the status quo. Let me up there. Motherfucker. Beck, what's wrong with you? I swear to God, there better not be an actual boss fight for this. God damn it. Mighty number eight signal has vanished. I have lost the target. My apologies. Okay, I really believe this is the same pattern. He shows up in what seems like the Oval Office. And then he goes back to the main hall. He still has his sights on you, Beck. Be careful. Then he heads back the other way again into like the conference room. <laughs> Fucking teleported already. I bet I didn't even maximize the damage I could do there. Fuck, I shouldn't have tried it. That's useless now. And what is with this level? The game just cannot keep up with how this level is. Get the fuck out of my sight. 
Right, move on to the next one. Wondering what happened to all the humans here, little doggy. They ran away. Cowards. Every single one of those meat sticks fled at the first sign of trouble. Pathetic. <laughs> Bring it on. That's Right. Not even full health still. Get out of my way, I swear to God. Here we go. Here we go. Right, what traps have you laying down here? See, I'm not the only robot tired of the status quo. Beck, you absolute son of a bitch, you better figure out a way to get up there. Fucking gone again. Perfect. Well, at least he's not in there. I can't figure out what the fuck I'm supposed to do in there. Maybe you can be content serving the whims of these flesh bags, but not me. My first executive order as the first robot president will be to set all bots free. God. Here we go. I needed that. <sighs> Need a little assistance, Spec. No problem. <laughs> That's what these sisters are for. I've, I've already my charge cards. done this room before. Okay, you could okay, show up in another room like where I one? actually you need help. I'll let you handle shade yourself. Toodles. Fuck, how are you supposed to... Can I climb those ropes? Is that what that is? Bring it on. That's more like it. Bring it on. That's more like it. Of course, the one spot I thought I was safe was actually where the fucking bullets That's were going. Like well, I'm safe here. Counter shade, how much more do I have to do with you? Where's he put his Motherfucker Oh my god I can't even just like skip this either. This like is the fight. And now I've got to deal with the goddamn game trying to rebuild itself. I detect no robots in the area capable of long range gunfire. Mighty number eight won't show up on any of your instruments. All part of my design. Beck, Shade is somewhere in the building. Trace the sniper fire back to its source. That's more like it. That's more. Do you ever think that maybe you should have given Beck like a special ability or something? I know that you can absorb them, but at this point it just feels like it doesn't even matter. I have lost the target. My apologies. Oh, shut up, Cole. And Dr. White and Shade. Just everyone shut up. My fucking god. No. You've already told me four or five times. Every single one of those meat sticks fled at the first sign of trouble. Pathetic. God damn it. You didn't show up in this room this time. Which means it's gonna. T oh, fucking. F Jesus. 
Here we go. Motherfucker. Bring it on. That's more like it. Bring it on. That's here we go. I feel like just tricking those bullet redirection things like that is the smallest. It's just like the one victory I can take from all this. And it's a shitty little victory, which means nothing. See, I'm not the only robot tired of the status quo. Oh my god, I actually managed to make it up there this time. How the fuck did I pull that off? Why could you not do that before? Maybe you can be content serving the whims of these flesh bags, but not me. My first executive order as the fuck. first robot. Just could you all just please just Here we go. Why the fuck are the statues fucking robots? Why is that a thing? I needed that. Need a little assistance, Spec? No problem. <laughs> Just go away, you're not needed here. Come help me when we find fucking shade. Did you like my pun? you gave me that one. How about you handle shade yourself? Toodles. Fuck you. Bring it on. That's more like That's more that's more like it. Stay here, I know it's safe. That's more like Bring it on. That's more like Oh my fucking god. That's more like <sighs> Right, are you done now? Oh. Settle this like robots. I'll meet you in my new office, little doggy. And this game just doesn't seem to be able to handle its own level. Oh, it's a new area too. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's very picturesque, but I mean, this game just is not dealing well with any of this. Okay. I better finish this in these lives. Okay, now little doggy. Let's see if you're all bark. Did I not prove that? Listen to me, Shade. You're malfunctioning. Freedom doesn't require all this suffering. Emancipation is worth any price, even if it costs human lives. Or yours. Match number eight, Counter Shade. This son of a bitch. How was that fine play? I was shot. Dance, little duck, nigga, adios. Here. Sloppy. Here. Seek. Need to re adios. Elliot. Here. Sloppy. Elliot. Sloppy. Here. Okay. So, will the humans give you a special treat for betraying your own kind? I don't know what that does. You've got it all wrong, Shade. I'm here because I want to help you. Next time. Elliot. Which is it? Sloppy. Which is it? Need to read adios. Which is it? Sloppy. Come on. Sloppy. Just need it. That was the easiest boss fight. Thank fuck. 
Holy shit. I owe you one, don't I, Beck? Mission. Clear. Good God. Right, I better get a high fucking rank for that, because I blitz that. A. Thank you. Mother of God. New form, counter shade. Woo. Oron becomes a sniper instead of a magnum or something like that. Stuperendous job, Beck. Come back to base and then uh, let's see. Professor, we are receiving an urgent call from Cherry Dynamics. I will patch it through. Sanda! Sanda! Oh, Sanda! Thank goodness. Great Graham here. <clears throat> Mr. Graham, what a pleasant surprise to hear from you. Drop the axe, Sanda. You don't like me, and I don't like you. But we need your help. It's our factory here. It's out of control. It's cranking out hostile bots, and we can't stop it. Confirming. Confirmed. Defective Cherry Dine robots are rampaging throughout the city. God, Zooks, that is not good. We'll send help right away. Right, William? Uh, yes, yes, of course. But, Mr. Graham, one question. What makes you so sure Blackwell is behind this? Sonda, who is this idiot? Who else would it be, boy? That smelly old fart is obviously out for revenge. Now stop asking stupid questions and send help! Whoa. Pleasant as always, that Mr. Graham. Sonda, I'll take the mighty numbers and handle the situation at the robot factory. You take call and find Dr. Blackwell at the prison. You mean go myself? To the prison? Like, actually, physically go there? Huh. I suppose it's the only way to contact Dr. Blackwell under the circumstances of this. Uh, but are you sure you don't want to swap missions? I, I think you, of all people, would, would want to see him, right? On the contrary, I'd be quite content to never see him again for the rest of my life. New content in extra mode is here. Go ahead and choose your next target. Right, okay, so just as I thought we get... Oh, we've got two missions. We have to go through each one then. We've got the prison, see Dr. Blackwell, and the robot factory to quell the rampage in robot factory. So, thank you very much for joining me in this one, guys. The level in and of itself was just about as infuriating as the others have been but thankfully the boss fight wasn't quite at least I didn't find it quite as difficult as some of the others have been so yeah thank you very much for watching guys and I will see you in the next one